Hey guys, it's Rue and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am here to do a haul with you. This is my part two of my haul from Orlando when I went to Disney with my mom. And so today you guys are gonna get to see everything that I bought that's luxury. I hope you guys are interested in that. And if you are, stick around for more. So guys, this is my part two to the shopping haul that I did from when I went to Orlando with my mom. Um, we went to the Vineland Outlets and we also went to the Mall of Millennia, which is a great mall that they have there as well. Today I'm going to show you everything that I bought that's luxury. And so I'm excited to do that with you, starting with what I have on. And yes, I am wearing the same outfit that I had on last video because I don't have time to change. I have a lot to do. Anyways, starting with the first item, which is this gorgeous Versace like windbreaker style jacket that I have on. I love it. I couldn't believe it was there and I couldn't believe the price because it was truly on sale. If you ever get an opportunity to go to luxury outlets, please do. You find such great finds. And I like Versace because Versace is a little bit extra. It's a little gaudy, but you know, I, I know how to also tone it down a little bit. So I have this really cute, like I said, windbreaker jacket that I got from Versace. It does zip up. I still have the tag on it, so excuse me as I put it on but it's really cute oh gosh i'm gonna i don't want to mess it up tags getting stuck hold on okay i'm back <laughs> and i'm zipped up so this is the windbreaker and um it fits really really good i like it a lot it's got the i think this is called and i might be wrong don't don't come for me the baroque i believe pattern if it's not, I don't know what it's called, um, but it doesn't say, I don't know, but it's one of the classic patterns or prints from um, Versace, so I'm very excited to have it. Um, it goes all the way around to the back and underneath would be black. So, oh, I am like, I was so happy to get this because I've been wanting some Versace items, but I didn't want like a total shirt with the whole pattern on it or print on it. I didn't want, um, you know, a skirt or a dress. This was perfect and this was definitely my cup of tea, my style. I could wear this and feel, you know, confident and, you know, cute and casual. I love it. Okay, my next item I got from the mall because Chanel doesn't have outlets. Yes. It's a piece of Chanel. I love Chanel too. <laughs> I love them all. But it's just a pair of earrings, nothing too fancy. So little packaging stuff that comes with it. So I've been wanting a pair of Chanel hoops. I have a few pair of Chanel earrings, but I have not been able to score any hoops. Every time I go to my local Chanel, um, they don't have a big jewelry selection and they sell out of everything really, really quickly. I'm not on their like VIP list or anything. So, you know, I have a Chanel um, uh, client advisor um, in Miami and she will help me find things because I've done a lot of business with her. However, um, I haven't bought anything recently so we haven't been in touch. So I was able to land these hoops. They are the, like the chain that goes within the classic flaps with the CC. Oh my God, they're so cute. I love them. I can't wear it to, I can't wait to wear them, but this gives you a glimpse of what they look like on my ears. It actually doesn't look bad with this jacket. I may have to style it together. I told you I could be extra. <laughs> but I was able to find these. Um, I do have a little story about the salesperson that I work with, but that's another that's a story for another time. However, the service was not that great. And He's lucky that I really wanted these earrings because I wouldn't have purchased them from him. But, but regardless, I got my earrings and they're so cute and I'm so happy to have them. Yay! 
I need a little sip. I have a iced chai here from Starbucks. That's like my favorite drink from there, but I don't always do so well with caffeine. So I don't, I'm trying not to drink it so much. Okay, and then on to my last few bits. They come from <laughs> who else but Gucci. I think you guys know that by now. If you've been watching my videos, I have expressed that many, many times. And I was able to pick up three pieces from my favorite fashion house, Gucci. So starting with the first piece, it's something that I didn't think I would ever buy, but I really, really like the print and pattern. And I was excited to see that they had it because this is an old, um, this is from a, a almost an old collection. I don't know the exact collection. However, I know that it's a few years old. So, but I'm still excited to share it with you. So here we go. All right, so my first piece are these shorts. Okay, I like them. Now, I'm not a big shorts person. I don't really like to show my legs, but I am really trying to come out of my comfort zone. I haven't been into showing my legs for years, actually decades, since I was in high school. However, because I don't have the prettiest legs, but I'm trying to get over that and wear shorts and wear skirts and wear dresses. Everything I wear is typically long. So I wear dresses, but typically like a maxi dress or a midi dress. But I've added a pair of Gucci shorts and I'm so excited. I love this print. And when I saw it, okay, um, they had this one pair left. And the lady was like, I don't know if they're gonna fit you. They're really large. But I was like, I'll try them on anyways because these are like three sizes too big for me. But with an elastic waist and a belt, we're gonna make this work. So I tried them on. I thought about three or four different ways that I could style them. And I love them. They work. They're gonna be fine. They don't need to be super tight. They don't need to be tight at all. And they're not. And I'm just excited to have them in the price. Y'all, oh, a pair of Gucci shorts for like, I think they were $70. That's like insane. I just couldn't believe it. So I'm excited to add these to my collection. Yay! Okay, moving on to my next piece. It's another ready to wear piece. And y'all, I'm really, really excited to add ready to wear items. Um, I do have a few Gucci items already. Um, I have lots of accessories, lots of shoes. Um, lots of handbags already from them, but I mean a few pieces ready to wear. But I don't know what it is about jackets, but I got another jacket, another windbreaker. Ta-da! Isn't she cute? Oh my god! I love this jacket. I'm not going to put it on or anything, but it's another windbreaker style jacket. I love it. It runs a little bit longer in the back, so it's kind of low in the in the front and a little bit longer in the back. Um, I had it on when I went in there. I had like leggings on and some sneakers. I hate the term chef's kiss, but chef's kiss. So cute. So classic Gucci with the green and the red webbing here. And then it's black at the top. And there's some blue as well. Oh, I love it. So I'm so excited to have this in my collection. So not only did I get one ready to wear piece from the outlet, I got two and I love them both. But now is the time we've all been waiting for. Drum roll, please. Okay, y'all. All right, so I went inside and I saw a bag that I wanted, oh, sorry, for, for, for years and I wasn't able to get it. I also saw another YouTuber get this bag years ago, or maybe not years ago, maybe a year ago. And I was like, oh my God, I want that bag, I want that bag. But this bag has been gone for years. Um, I wanna say at least four years. And so when I walked in, I had every intention of buying that not every intention I was kind of like I thought about it I thought about it I thought about it but then I wanted it but at the very last minute there was another bag in the same family different color and 
it also caught my attention. It caught my attention so much so that I chose it instead. I have another Dionysus piece or Dionysus, whatever it is, because I've heard it both ways. She's beautiful. Oh my God. Look at her. Oh my God, y'all. I'm not worshiping a bag or anything, but she's cute and she's not black <laughs> the other bag was black and she's color she is um a suede this is suede this is leather this is velvet and she's got crystals all around her y'all <laughs> i couldn't resist <laughs> Okay, so let me let me let me chill out. But this is my new bag. She is beautiful. I'm so excited to add her. And the other bag that I was going to get was also a bag from this collection, but it was black. Um, it had some embroidery on it, and I'm still on the hunt, or I'm still wanting to add that bag. Um, this is my favorite collection from Gucci. Is the Dionysus or Dionysus? I don't know what to say so if you know how to properly say it like properly and someone is not gonna tell me no it's the other way around let me know um but I've been saying it both ways forever because I've literally gone into Gucci and heard it both ways and I'm just not sure which way is the proper way but it is my favorite collection and there are about two or three more bags that I want from this collection but this one stole the show it stole my heart and I decided to get the yellow bag. I'm excited. And so, you know, what can I say? I'm a Gucci girl. I've been a Gucci girl. Today I'm a Versace girl. I'm excited about this too. I love my items. I hope you do too. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. So that does it for my luxury haul from Orlando, guys. I hope you like what you've seen. And if you have a favorite piece from what I hauled today, please drop it down in the comments section down below. I appreciate you guys tuning in to watch my videos. And I hope that if you haven't done so by now, that you would consider subscribing to my channel, hitting that notification bell so that you are notified when I release new content. And if you would like and share and all the things to make my channel grow. I appreciate you and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.